Hi, my name is Betsy O'Leary and I'm a physical therapy student at Elon University. I'm here today to talk to you about an article I read on iontophoresis and the treatment of plantar fascia, fascia heel pain. The article is titled Manual Physical Therapy and Exercise versus Electrical Physical Agents and Exercise in the Management of Plantar Heel Pain, a Multi-Centered Randomized Control Trial. This article was published in the Journal of Orthopedics and Sports Physical Therapy by Joshua Cleveland, Haxby Abbott, Martin Kidd et al. There was a level 1b evidence. The purpose of the study was to compare the effectiveness of two different conservative management treatment approaches in the treatment of plantar fascia heel pain. The target population was patients with a primary report of plantar heel pain, and the type of electrotherapy used was iontophoresis. The parameters for this electrotherapy was 40 milliamp minutes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set Amy up to the iontophoresis. I've prepared the active pad with the dexamethasone, and I'm going to put it on her plantar, the plantar surface of her heel. Next, I'm going to ground the electrode. Place this on her leg. This is the iontophoresis machine, and I've set it to two, an amplitude of two, and we'll do the treatment for 20 minutes, which would be 40 milliamp minutes. I'm placing a negative, um, the negative on the active electrode because dexamethasone requires the negative. And then I will press start. And we will be here for 20 minutes for the dosage of 40 milliamp minutes. The outcomes measure in this study between group differences compared to the manual therapy and exercise had the manual therapy group had statistically significant greater improvements on the LEFS scale and greater improvements in the pain scale at the four-week follow-up compared to the electrophysical agents group. Both groups showed st statistically significant change. However, only the manual therapy group demonstrated um, were able to reach the NCID for the test at the four-week follow-up. Um, the results of this study demonstrate that manual therapy with exercise is a superior treatment approach for compared to the electrophysical agent. Um, in my opinion, based on this article and my prior education, I would not recommend using iontophoresis for the treatment of plantar fascia heel pain, as it shows that faster and clinically significant results can be found with manual therapy and exercise. Thank you.